So what's the best way to conduct a workshop if you're teaching people communication skills? Well, there's the standard way. The standard way is someone who's quite articulate, stands up and lectures and gives demonstrations and talks, and then ask the participants to stand up. Hey, I'm gonna video record you. Get a two, three, five, maybe 10 minute video of each person, play it back, and then give it detailed critique. Here's everything you're doing well. Here's seven things you're doing well, TJ. And now here's 89 things you're doing wrong. And if you're in the workshop, it's interesting because it's about you. You've got that adrenaline rush of standing up and speaking. People are looking at you. You're being video recorded. You're thinking, wow, this is so much more interesting than last week's workshop on how to use Excel spreadsheets. So it's more exciting than a typical workshop. It's a little scarier. It's more interesting, it's more memorable. And when it's all done, you've maybe spoken, been recorded two, three times. You walk out of that training saying, wow, I learned so much today. That trainer, that trainer was fantastic. I got a great new role model. That trainer was dynamic and competent and smooth and professional. I learned a lot today. And I really learned that, wow, I'm still doing 72 things wrong. I really learned that I'm not a very good speaker. I really learned that, yeah, this isn't really my thing. Well, if only we could hire that trainer to speak on our behalf. If that's the sort of workshop you go to, don't feel too bad. That's how most people go to communication skills workshops. Welcome to the TJ Walker Success Channel. This is the place where I help you become more successful by learning how to boost your communication skills, your competency, and your confidence. Here's the problem. It was a waste of time. If that is the experience you have in a communication skills workshop, not only have you wasted time and money, you've actually made yourself a worse communicator because now your self-esteem is lower. That's not what you want in a communication skills workshop. The best trainers, when they stand up to start the lecture for the day, are brief. They speak very little. They get you to speak on camera. They record it. They show it to you. They get you to focus on what you like so you can do more of it. You focus on no more than one weakness at a time. Rather than telling you here's 89 things you're doing wrong, they'll focus on one thing at a time. Hey, TJ, I can't quite hear you all the way. Your voice is too low. Can you boost the volume a little in the next one? And you focus on one thing at a time and you do it again and again and again. In an ideal communication skills training workshop, you are on camera, not one or two or three times getting critiques. You are on camera 10 times in a day. Don't miss a beat on your journey to success. Tap the bell to receive notifications so you get constant updates for your own journey. Here's the real magic moment of a communication skills workshop. You need to be able to, at the end of the day, point to the screen saying, wow, if I could sound half as good as he does, if I can look and sound half as good as she does, in the next presentation I give, I'm gonna be the star of that seminar, meeting, conference, workshop. And you're pointing not to a video of your trainer, not to a video of Oprah or some famous speaker, but you're pointing to a video of yourself. Your thoughts matter, please, leave a comment below in the comment section or a question or a criticism or a complaint or praise. When you've done that, you now have a new role model for yourself. The role model is you and you are relatable to you. That is how you get the most out of a communication skills workshop. Can I ask you a personal favor? I'm trying to help more people just like you all around the globe improve their personal communication skills and to be more successful. If you hit the subscribe button, not only will I be able to help you, but that'll send a message to others around the world that this is a place for them. So please, as a small favor, hit subscribe.